hello everyone and welcome to or welcome back to my channel so today i thought i owed it to you to explain why i'm not going back to my high school for senior year this video is more of a sit down and talk kind of video i just kind of want to explain why i'm not going back and um yeah and just kind of talk about that because i feel like the only people that know are my close friends and my family. Everyone else doesn't really know that I'm not going back to my high school. So I just hope this clarifies. So the first reason why um, I decided not to go back to my high school was kind of just about the teachers. And I know they there's bad teachers everywhere, but I just felt really babied all the time. And like, I feel like I'm I'm more of an independent person and I don't need people constantly like on me telling me when to do things or how to do them or if I can or can't do something or stop eating in my classroom or like if I'm fidgeting with something like don't do that like I just need my own space and my own thinking time and I guess it's really hard to like progress when like you can't be in your own element and I feel like that's a really hard part about high school especially because there's so many kids in there that you like know that it's like really hard to like not agree with the teacher and since they are such a role model figure or like they're an adult you're supposed to really respect them but when you don't respect your teacher because they're treating you like a five-year-old that's <laughs> doesn't make you want to go back into that environment so that is definitely one of the main reasons that I don't want to go back. Another thing that I noticed a lot about high school that I just really didn't like is that there's too many classes going on at one time. I think that when you take six classes a day, your brain gets overwhelmed. I know they say work on homework a little bit every day and like stuff like that, but it's so hard to focus on a class when you have six classes or like when you have six classes of homework you can't put all of your energy in the night for studying that thing that you learned and that was a really like hard thing for me about high school is that when I get really stressed out um it kind of sh makes me shut down and I feel like last year my teachers noticed that that I would go on my phone a lot and that's another reason I would get yelled at and I totally get that because you shouldn't be on your phone while kid like teachers are teaching but I like couldn't my brain couldn't handle how much was going on around me and like if there was like a test next period and like a test the next period and then I had to turn in this giant assignment it was like it was like too much for my brain to like handle at one time and I'm just really happy that I'm getting out of this scenario and completing something that I know is going to be a lot healthier for me and in my environment. Another reason I'm fine with going to the community college is that I'm a very social person if you haven't met me, hence my YouTube channel. It's very uh, me. <laughs> this is probably one of the videos where I'm being more myself and I think it's because my family's not home and stuff like that. But even if you check in my vlogs, I'm very social and I do a lot of sports and clubs. Like I do cheer, I do tennis, I used to do leadership, like I used to do drama. Like I just have so many friends from different groups and that's not me like tooting my own horn or anything. It's just like it's very easy for me to ooh bug it's very easy for me to make friends and be social so i'm not very worried about that um i mean like all the friends i have like two or three close friends and when i miss them i hang out with them and that was one of my only reasons that was one of my only reasons that i liked going to the high school is seeing my friends and like getting to like talk to them and stuff like that um and i feel like school shouldn't be your place of social activity and if that's the only reason you're going and you literally hate everything about where you where you are that is not going to make you want to put yourself into schoolwork. uh you should be separating your social life i feel like with your it should be separate from your social life and your like school life it's too hard to put things together you will not focus on the schoolwork and when there's friends around you and that's just personally who i am because i'm so social and i'm so talkative that when i see a friend i'm like oh my gosh hey hey girl what's up let's be bffs <laughs> like but that's basically 
like how it is so I just know that like I'm gonna be social anyways and I don't need that especially because um, of like as I was saying at cheer like I'm not gonna miss any of the high school experience also like that was a, another big topic that people were like you're doing running start the, you're literally gonna miss out on the high school experience and I'm like I don't really think so like I'm sorry but I do cheer and I do tennis and I am all around doing stuff all the time like every pep assembly every football game I am at literally I'm gonna go to homecoming still so when people say that I'm like that is BS like I'm not the type of person that's expecting to walk down and win homecoming queen like my sister no like that's not me and like when people are like oh my gosh don't you want to win homecoming queen like your sister I'm like no I really don't like no offense to that but like sure that'd be really cool like I'd love to be on court and I think that that's a really fun bonding experience and like having fun with your senior class but like that's something that if people wanted me to be there, I'd want to be there. But like, if I don't do it, I, I'm not gonna be like, oh my gosh, my day's ruined. I can't believe I wasn't on a homecoming court. Like, I guess that's just kind of how I am and my mindset of things. But yeah, that's, I guess, how I feel about the high school experience topic. Uh, another reason that this is so good for me is that I stay up so late. I am someone that will stay up until forever. I love staying up and I love doing things on my own time and going to bed when I can. And with my uh, doing my classes at the college, as you guys know, it's all the classes are at different times and you pick classes that go to, and fit your needs. So like all of my classes for this first quarter are start at 12 and I have one class a day. So I have one class Monday, Wednesday, 12 to two. I have one class Tuesday, Thursday, 12 to two, and I have one online. So technically I have to go to one class a day and I have to wake up at 12. First of all, there's scientific research that proves that going to school later in the day will help your brain function because you're not just waking up and doing your work. You're already proactive. Like right now, it's 1136. I would be at school right now. I've had six hours <laughs> to freaking wake up basically in the time that I would be in school. I am so much more awake and I am, I feel like I, this is the time where I process <laughs> things the most. Like whenever I have classes around 11.30, um, really like alive for them and not like dead or hungry or things cause I can eat before and I can be awake, <laughs> I guess. That's, um, that's what I really enjoy about it too. Another thing that I think is really beneficial about doing Running Start is that your credits transfer over to when you go to college. It, I am taking the exact same classes I would be taking at the high school, except I'm getting college credits for them. So which means is when I go over to the college of my choice, all of my credits will go over there and I might graduate sooner. Do I want to? No, I want to save for the four years, but that saves my parents some money and me some money from when I go to college or when I have some student debt or whatever. I won't have that because I literally have already started if that makes sense. It's like a little, like I know it's only a year of credits that's happening, but it's better than nothing. <laughs> and that's what I can say. Another thing that I really wanted to focus on this year is getting a job. As I've said, I'm going to college next year. My family is really um, like pro-college, like everyone in my family goes to college. So um, when you walk into college, I wanna be able to say I have money saved up and that I can do things if I want to. Like if I want to rush and join a sorority that I'll have money uh, for all the expensive events because you have to buy t-shirts all the time and go to all these events and pay your dues and college is expensive man and like as much as like my parents might help me with it or like whatever I need like a lot of it is myself like if I want to go out to eat like I have to pay for that like that's just how that is if my friends and I want to go to a movie I have to pay for that and like I don't expect to just like find the money <laughs> like you know like like I just need it and I just think that that's gonna be like a really valuable thing and especially all the kids at my age right now they're not gonna have any money for this stuff like um, they won't have money when they go to college maybe a little bit from over the summer but even my sister worked a nannying job before she went to college and like blew it all like so fast because of her sorority stuff and I just think it's really nice to have options friends they all don't have time to have jobs because they all do sports and school but since I only have two hours a day of school, then I can go and get whatever job that like I need to get, especially because I turn 18 in October, holla. Um, I can get a nice job and 
uh, like a part-time job and like make myself be able to pay for those activities because I said I pay for those also so it's like if my friends are like oh let's go to the pumpkin batch I'm like I don't have money for that and I'm like sorry like I just don't and I just think that would be like a really cool thing uh, the next thing that a uh, reason of why I'm super excited to go and do my classes there is that I get to choose the classes that I like um, I mean of course you need your standard like math science or whatever like blah 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 whatever I need but like right now I'm able to take it's business English and government which literally are the like two of those things are things that I really want to do when I get older like I want to be a history teacher maybe and I want to be a business like person like later in life so it's like yeah like you can take history and classes at the college but it's like I'm focusing on things that I want to and getting that career path of like which one I want to like go into when I'm older and when I'm going to college so I think this is just like a really nice thing and my last and final reason which you guys might think is going to be stupid and I'm totally I totally will understand it like but hear me out um since I was in sixth grade as I've told you I've been off and on on this YouTube channel and I feel like I just get a lot of passion for it like even right now um I haven't been able to talk to people how I've been able to talk to this camera or even my phone in the past but I just feel so comfortable when I do it and like I feel my problems like really listen to and I feel like I've grown this community around my channel that's really helpful I just I just really enjoy making my YouTube videos and it sounds so stupid but I want this to actually become a hobby and I think that with having my time more <laughs> Like having more time to produce YouTube videos, it's actually going to bring me a lot of happiness and a lot more, um, I get, get, keep me more focused. Like something about, um, YouTube, like goals, I like set them for myself. Like it feels like a business. And as I said, I want to be like a business major when I'm older. And so something about me sitting in front of this camera and like building this business is such a great feeling. Like... I'm literally, I get to tell you guys everything I want to tell you. I get to show all of my memories and put them on the internet for all my friends to see and for me to look back on when I'm sad. And and the fact that one day I might make money out of it, which is not my goal at all. Like, I really don't care. Uh, I mean, it's going to be nice at one point, like, what, like maybe if a, an extra cent comes through, but that is not the reason, like, I'm doing it. I just found so much joy in my heart for video production and just learning how to grow my channel and like find other creators and like how to learn different things and like I want to like show you guys that like I learned how to screen record on my Mac and I learned how to go live which might seem easy for you guys but like I am not a tech person and I like really get into it and I won't let myself go to sleep sometimes until I like get that skill like those were two different nights where I was like screen record like I want to learn how to screen record on my thing in case I want to do like some random video like where I'm like showing you guys how to like do iMovie tips like I want to learn how to do that and I'm like pushing myself and like something about it is like such like it feels good and I like, people don't understand it I get it but like it's my thing and I really enjoy it and I'm just happy that now I'm gonna have more time to make myself happy rather than kind of like going through something that's making me unhappy so that those are literally all my reasons for doing classes at the college and if you think that this could be right for you in the future definitely go for it i'm gonna be giving updates about this that's my hope um i want to kind of touch on things and like explain my experiences with things with professors and like stories because i just think that it's really helpful and I want to be like a big sister on YouTube and someone that can you can come to to like learn things so yeah again I keep rambling on but that's it and I hope you guys enjoyed my little talk with me I haven't really done any of these yet but I want to do more so that's it all right bye guys Look,